Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Rose Girls haul and I'm sure some of you are like, really, you're doing a wax haul finally? <laughs> I know some of my videos have been kind of not the norm. They all, I feel like all of my videos still have to do with scent though because I still really love scent in general. I have done a few like clean with me type videos so that I guess wouldn't be scent related, but it is somehow because you're using cleaning products that are nicely scented, so. I guess that's kind of could be included in the scent category. So I've just been going through some things. I don't know. I've just been trying to do some different things. I've been interested in other things. I, I mean, I have so much wax at this point that it's just like, how much more wax could one person possibly have? It's just to the point where I need to slow down. So that and just like coupled with a couple other things i've just had to really like kind of i don't know do some different things here and there and i kind of took a little bit of like a week break i, I don't even know if you can consider what i do taking a break <laughs> i do that in air quotes <laughs> but anyways all right let's just get right into it so jenny outdid herself on this restock i mean i am freaking yeah, I am dying over here. Jenny, I don't I don't think Jenny watches these videos, but um, yeah, she outdid herself. Everything is like just whoa. I, her whole team, I guess, Jenny and her whole team, because she's not the only one. I, I know she has people helping her in the, what's the word, like backstage or whatever the hell you want to say. But look at this card. Oh my goodness. So this is the pre-order, A Merry Mario Christmas, and... So Mario Brothers takes me back to when I was a kid and that was like the first Nintendo game that was like popular and I remember like when I got my first Nintendo and it came with Super Mario Brothers I thought I was in freaking heaven like this game is so fun so and then also my friend Candy had said that this is one of her favorite collections so I was like I'm all about that and she has good taste so I figured I might as well check it out so there's that and then I think Jenny might have changed her card because I I mean it's been a while since I've ordered Rose Girls but so this is her card so it's Rose um, rgwax.com is the thing I love that very simplistic but yet like sophisticated love that and then so I know it's stupid to get excited about paper but <laughs> it's Christmas paper I think that is freaking adorable was packed on the top and so I didn't even see this until I was going through my order and getting the scent descriptions. <coughs> Sorry. So I was getting the scent descriptions and pulling out some of my order and I came across this and I was like, oh my gosh, that is so adorable. So it's a little ornament. This is going on my tree today. And this is, I don't even want to try to pronounce this lady's name or it could be a guy. I think it's a girl. Uh, you just never know. It could be a girl, but um, yeah, that's what it is. And this is the sweetest little ornament. That is so cool that Jenny included that in here. Like, I don't know, just ornaments just get me in general. So it's just a cute little bell and it's got a little snowflake on top and it's just super cute and I love it. That was just above and beyond for Jenny to do that. So. Thank you, Jenny. And not that she's watching, but you know, just in case she ever does. Thank you. <laughs> that was a nice little like surprise in there. I was like super excited and like, oh my God, you know. Okay. So I ordered a lot of the muffins and what I've been doing is one thing with Rose Girls. Let me put this in front of the camera. One thing with Rose Girls is don't just buy one chunk muffin because you're going to get it and then you're going to be like damn it why didn't i order two or three so i always order two of the chunk muffins almost all the time unless i think a scent might be questionable uh i think i have one thing in here that i ordered only one of in the chunk muffins and then if you get a bigger quantity like the what was she calling them the mario melters and her chunk bags i you know you only need one of those because those are pretty full so this first one is bomb blast or you know something along those lines and this is an excuse my <laughs> handwriting blackberry campfire marshmallow vanilla bean oil and glazed donuts this one i remember 
was very heavy on the blackberry. There's gonna be a lot of crinkling, sorry. Yeah, so these chunk muffins are always like super cute. And yeah, this one's very strong on blackberry to me. Now when I'm smelling it now though, I do smell the bakery goodness that's coming out. I, I, it's so weird. I got a few campfire marshmallow blends in here in this order and I can't smell any of the campfire marshmallow. I don't know if it's just hiding in there or what, but so that's that. So the next one I got, of course, I had to get Star Beans Cafe, which is a coffee blend, of course. You know I gotta get those coffee blends. And this is Espresso Vanilla Crunch Donuts, and you know I'm all about Vanilla Crunch Donuts and Vanilla Bean Noel. and smells so good. I love vanilla crunch donuts. Such a good scent to mix with coffee. Just a good coffee blend. Creamy. Love it. So that's, I got a second one of the Star Beans Cafe. I'll put that over there. And that bomb blast, another bomb blast should be in here somewhere. There you are. Okay, so I got two of the bomb blasts. And the next one I got, I believe is from our friend Josh. He is active in, I think, Wax Chat and a couple other groups. So Choco Mountain was his blend that he came up with. This is hot cocoa, cup of cake, dunk my donut, and vanilla ice cream and everything I love in there. Okay, so this one you definitely have to like the chocolate scent, like chocolate smells. Um, I'm trying to think of other blends that would have the chocolate smells, but I'm, it's escaping me right now, but you definitely have to like hot cocoa. Where did my, okay, I'm losing scent descriptions. <laughs> yeah, this one to me mostly smells like hot chocolate. So, and sometimes, you know, things need a little bit of cure time. Cause I love cup of cake, dunk my donut and you know, ice cream, so. We'll just set that one out and see if it cures up. So I did grab two. So I found another one of that one. This one is super fun. So this is Jumping on Clouds. Oh, come on. There goes my scent description again. I, these are just not sticking, but look how pretty that is. How fun with the different colors. Oh, okay, so Jumping on Clouds is Vanilla Crunch Donuts Fluff Puffs. I love the Fluff Puff scents. I think my friend Erin had told me Fluff Puffs is Monster Cookie and Roll Sugar Cookie combined, which is, I can always smell the Monster Cookie when these blends have them in there. Marshmallow smoothie, cup of cake, and cotton candy frosting. Yeah, this one I don't know how I feel about yet. It smells good. It smells pretty good. Uh, I feel like it needs some curing. Yeah. But I can I could smell that monster cookie and then I couldn't. So I think sometimes your nose like plays little tricks on you. Let's see, I think somewhere I have a second one of those. Where are you? Okay, my nose is, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. My nose is, uh, it's a mess. It's like the weather keeps changing from like cold to like warm, cold to warm. It's just, yeah. Two turtle Koopas. And is this the one I'm thinking? Yeah, I was super excited to smell this one. Vanilla sandalwood and cinnamon glazed oranges. I just didn't know. I was like, that sounds so interesting. I'm not going to take this one out. So you really smell the cinnamon glazed oranges. And you it's kind of like the oranges, the orange scent, like that... Um, like a juicy orange. It's kind of toned down a little bit by the vanilla sandalwood. 
but I don't know that I'd be able to make out vanilla sandalwood right away. Whew, that one is very citrusy. Excuse me. Okay, that was awful. I think the cinnamon glazed oranges just like threw me over the top there. Okay, <laughs> Warp Zone is a Monster Cookie Fluff Puffs Peppermint and Vanilla Crunch Donuts. Oh, I love her peppermint. Her peppermint is everything. Oh, you really get the peppermint. You can kind of smell the Monster Cookie Fluff Puffs in there. Wait a minute, Monster Cookie Fluff Puffs. So wait, is Fluff Puffs something else then? I thought it was Monster Cookie and Royal Sugar Cookie, but maybe I'm, maybe it's Royal Sugar Cookie and her other cookie scent. Uh, who the hell knows? Okay, anyways, very peppermint. Very peppermint with bakery, I love that one. Warp Zone. I think she's having some sort of ready to ship type of thing with the leftovers. Try to get that one if you can. That one's good if you like peppermint. Um, okay, here's my second warp zone. Like I said, I don't mess around with the muffins. I go ahead and just grab two. Okay, so I grabbed two of these, which is the, I don't know how to say that, thwomps. <laughs> I sound like I have a lisp, thwomps. <laughs> So this is pine peppermint, pine peppermint sugar cookie dough and campfire marshmallow. Oh, that one's okay. That one's good. Again, with the peppermint, it's not as strong as in the warp zone. It's a little bit lighter in the um, thwomps. I smell the pine. Oh, that's good. I'm getting like a peppermint pine, which is really nice. I should mix those. I think I have a pine um, mini melter in my stash somewhere. I should mix peppermint and pine. That's an interesting combo. Okay, the one I only grabbed one of in the muffins is Delicate Daisy. And that's just because I just didn't know what the Victoria's Secret bombshell was and cotton candy frosting. So I, I was trying to remember, I know I've smelled bombshell before sometime in my life but I just don't remember it that well. It's been a while. And I, I remembered it once I smelled it and I, I'm i on the fence about it. I'm sure it'll make a nice bathroom melt. Yeah, it's like a, I remember when I first smelled it, I thought, did I order a fruity blend? So I'm thinking bombshell is fruity at some, somehow, some way. Okay. So the next one I grabbed in a chunk bag is I went ahead and grabbed Grandma Got Run Over by a Chain Chomp. And so you get these chunks look like this. This is blackberry jam butter cookies, cotton candy frosting, and waffle cone. I've had this one before and I didn't love it on cold, but on warm it was much better. It's a really strong blackberry scent in here. I think I remember the last time I hauled this one or warmed it. I remember saying it didn't smell like blackberry jam butter cookies to me. It smelled more like blackberry. Blackberry jam butter cookies has a very unique scent. This one actually smells more blackberry from what I'm smelling. I can't really smell waffle cone. I don't know, it might be in there. I think some of this stuff needs curing. Usually when I come back to these things after a while, it's like they smell, they smell like, you know, uh, more complex. Okay, this one I'm super excited about. Have yourself a Merry Mario Christmas. I wouldn't mind grabbing like three of these. This is Peppermint Mocha Cookies and Dunk My Donut. Oh, this one is so, so good. So the peppermint mocha is the outstanding note. I do get the kind of like the, um, the spiciness from the Dunk My Donut. I always feel like Dunk My Donut is kind of spicy, uh, kind of cinnamon. Not No, cinnamon is kind of a bad, uh, bad word to use that, but more spicy. I love that. Okay, and the last one I have is 
Koopa Claws needs a latte, and I do have a couple muffins in this one, but I felt like I needed the Mario Melters version because I feel like I'm gonna need more of this. So now I have it. It's espresso, espresso, baked zucchini bread, royal sugar cookies, and Gilligan's brew. Oh, this one smells great. If you're scared of zucchini bread, I wouldn't be scared of this blend at all. I feel like this one is pretty light on the zucchini bread. I feel like you're getting more of like coffee bakery. Oh, that one's good. Okay. <clears throat> so, outstanding order. If you can get in on that ready to ship restock, I would definitely do it. If you have any questions about any of the scents, you want me to smell them again for you and, you know, let you know if something's more this or that, I'm more than happy to do that. And yeah, just super awesome order. Like how cool. I don't know why I'm so like enthralled with a little mini ornament, but I just think that is like the greatest thing. <laughs> so yeah, again, she really outdid herself. Super excited and glad to have some more Rose Girls in my life. And I think that's it, you guys. I do have some upcoming videos coming up. I am going to do a warmer tour. Now that I have an editing program, I can start and stop my camera. No problem now. And uh, what else is I going to do? I was going to do something else wax related. Oh, a wax collection tour. That's coming up as well. So yeah, I am kind of getting back into the swing of things. It's just been a little bit... Um, slow <laughs> you could say okay thank you guys so much for watching please feel free to leave comments down below you guys know i love talking with you guys and it's been a while so come on and talk okay i'll talk to you guys later bye